Medical Records Management. It's MyOrganized.life, live, October 23rd, 2018. <laughs> Uh-oh, something's coming Just on. Just kidding. you got a cold coming on. you got to pull out your medical <laughs> I records, i got to get right? the medical records. Oh, That's what we're at. talking about today, but yeah. for the home. For the home. You okay. failed to mention that in the intro. Oh, for the home. For the home. On, anyway. On MyOrganized.life Live, I'm John Hunt. And I'm Leanne Thompson. This is the show where I give you organizing tips, advice. Uh, Make and corny, corny jokes. Very corny jokes. Bad. But according to audience research, that's what people like about this show. Ah, of course. I don't know who. That's like your mom and Hazel. my daughter. Hazel likes Hazel the banter. Likes, Hazel, do you like the Shauna banter? Shauna Turner likes the banter. Shauna likes the banter, too. Okay, well, there's two people. There's two out of two however out of, many people two out of watch five our show. People. Yeah, no. Anyway, anyway, today. Yeah, well, medical records management. That sounds kind of like we're going to the clinic and uh, we're seeing all the. What is the what is the deal with medical records management? I don't know, but I think you. It's important to have. But I think if someone really wanted to go a little more in depth, they would go and find this article. Yes, that's what we're talking Sme. about. Com. You go into the search bar, and what would they type? Re uh, medical records management. Mm -hmm. That would probably be a good one. Yeah, and uh, and you'll find a nice picture of some three-ring binders. Nice. So okay. this we we're talking. You know, a lot of people are going to say, "Well, I can just everything's online at my clinic." You know, I just yeah. log in and see everything. Except but when the internet's down. When the internet's down. Like, That's true. But yeah, when the internet's down. You have down cable or, like I do, and I'm not even going to say the city. I'd probably get sued. Probably. But it's terrible. Really. I'm like rebooting the router every day. Oh, it's crazy. Gosh, that's not so fun. I don't so, yeah, trust if, online if quite yet. Is Dead, if you don't and have internet. And my brand new iPhone, well, less than a year old, has been like doing being weird. I don't know if some software oh, updates no. got. Anyway, so uh, anyway, so it's good to have it's paper. It's good to have paper. Plus, we backups, sell, and it's easier. We sell paper-based products, so we need to promote paper. Yes, we're gonna promote, promote. Okay, promote. So, so medical records management. Just give basically, me this says you have a three-ring binder. Okay. You have different sections on what you need to keep in okay. each section. Current medications include the name of the drugs as well as your dosage. Right. Immuniz immuniz Immunization. There you go. Thank you. Yeah. Um, children as well as young adults need to have up-to-date information, so it's right. nice. You know, my daycare lady likes to have an update of what the kids right. have had and stuff like that. So it's nice to keep a page for that. Allergies. Mm -hmm. If you're allergic to something, nice right. reminder. Your health history, which is a good one, especially, yes, absolutely. you know, if you are kind of feeling just off, not just a cold, but yeah. if you go to the doctor and oh, do you have a family history? It's like, Ooh, oh, yeah. I, don't, I don't know. Yeah, Let me yeah. check. Yeah, it's yeah. good too because as generations move, mm -hmm. they don't maybe know what the other generation right. had. And then your labs slash test results okay. are a good section to keep. Now, I am married to a nurse practitioner, mm -hmm. and uh, so whenever like a kid starts to get sick, yes. she has like a little log. You know, at oh. ten thirty at night, oh. you know, they started coughing, and you know, and then she kind of follows the, you oh, know, and, okay. then, and we gave this medication at, you know, this time, and it's so, a good idea. Yeah, so good that idea. might be a section too. Yep. Also, that way, and the reason she does that is mm -hmm. like if you go into the doctor, and the doctor says, "Well, tell me a little bit, how long have you had?" Well, yeah. she knows. Yeah. Well, it started at ten thirteen yeah. on Friday. That's a great with idea. With one cough. Well, no, it's not like I'm bad. <laughs> kind of like the beginning of the show. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> anyway, uh, yep. so a log in there is a good thing too. I mean, I right. suppose you could do that digitally on like some right, kind of notepad or whatever. It's easier to grab it a note. Is. And yeah, just have it somewhere. Have yeah. it right there. Yep. And then they talk about um, me medical records management for an ongoing illness. Oh, okay. You might want to keep this maybe in a drawer yeah. or a file drawer right. and grab some hanging folders yeah. and. Maybe keep your bills, you know, your right. ongoing bills. That can be a, a headache right. at the end of a, an yeah. illness or something. Insurance claims. There's a whole list of stuff that yeah. people can see if they go to the article. They go to the article. Go to SME.com. Go up in that search bar to uh, type medical management, records management, yep. and you right. come up with this article. Yep. Uh, there's more information. Now, when I look at this, you know, you think, Man, I think, why on well, earth okay, did you we pick got this article. Well, to talk you've got about? like notebooks, you've got file folders, you've got, you know, three ring binders, three ring binders with the tabs, and we have right. like the, you know, the super tab. Yes, and we don't even sell three ring binders. I know, but we sell the t the tab dividers. Right. Right. Yes. But so you got all that stuff. They're going to run out, piece, piece it together. What if you had a product? that had all mm, that together that would be in one. Grand. Now, normally on Thursday, we'd have Solution Day, but I just but you are just to say, why are we, we doing this? Here? Oh, we my. The all-in-one healthcare 
and wellness organizer. This gets it all done for you. Right. It's got the uh, tab sections here. Even you comes with. Even comes with the uh, labels pre. Pre-printed. Printed. Yep. Plus or you, you can, can make, make your, your own. own. And what it also comes with, which everyone loves. This is loves. the big. This is it. The wheel of point. organization. So it tells you what you need in mm -hmm. each place. This is a great little organizer. Right. I guess you could get this at myorganized.life. Um, yes. The all-in-one healthcare and wellness organizer. But since this isn't solution day, I'm going to put this away because I don't want to. Right. We don't want to. We don't want people to think show. all we're doing is uh, pitching products no. every day. We don't Why would we do that? Well, we would do know. that to help the company, but uh, <laughs> right. anyway, well, maybe someday on Solution Day we'll feature that. But I think so we there are options. You know, you can that. do your own, do it yourself. Get some hanging folders, mm -hmm. get some labels, get some you know notebook tabs, and then find some three ring binder yeah. somewhere. The point is, it's nice to have paper, yeah, physical stuff that you can yeah, carry with that. you to an appointment. Absolutely. You know, just to have on hand. Yeah, great. Well, that is a great article. Uh, go check that out, Smee.com. Yep. And, uh, you know, I was thinking it was Wednesday coming in here. I know, which isn't gosh. I know, it's really weird. I guess I'm pushing this week a lot faster. Well, yesterday than I, you were already promoting Friday. I was Friday, promoting so Friday, wasn't it? But tomorrow is Wednesday, and we have part two of our podcast with Lisa Woodruff, mm -hmm. Friday Organizing Box. Business Organizing. The yep. Business Box, yeah. The business Box. And uh, it's a neat concept, I think, especially if you have, like, a home-based business. She's she very is smart. very sharp. Mm -hmm. So check that out. We do that live here on Facebook at 2 p.m., Central, 3 Eastern, noon Pacific, and then as I get through the rest of the day, we get it on iTunes and YouTube mm -hmm. and the MyOrganized.life blog, yes. so all those different areas. That's just Wednesday. Yes, Thursday. Thursday will be a solution, solution day. day. We now, don't we've know already what we're given about. one solution today, but no, you'll have something this is different. a bonus week. Bonus week. You yeah. get two solutions in one week. <laughs> and then on Friday, Blog way down, it. way at the end of the way, week on Friday. Can oh you my see goodness, it down there? It's getting closer and closer to the weekend as we speak. <laughs> yes, it is. Uh, blogger Roundup. We uh, we searched the blogosphere for the best blogs on organizing. And if you have one that you like, put it in the comments because we're always looking for new things, right? Yes. So uh, now we have our regular standbys that we go to, but that's because they blog they a lot. They blog regularly. Yeah, yeah, so you know they get rewarded for doing that. <laughs> <That's>, they, <laughs> they get perks. They get, they get perks. They get featured on the show on Fridays. Yes. So anyway, well, that's it for today's show. We will be back tomorrow at 2 p.m. Central, 3 Eastern, and noon Pacific right here on MyOrganized.life live. Stock up on your favorite organizing products now at MyOrganized.life. This is the perfect time of year to equip your office with file folders, expanding files, project organizers, and more. And introducing our new bright white folder line that coordinates with any office decor. It's easy, shop online, and it's delivered right to your office. Stock up now on your favorites with everything you need at myorganized.life. That's myorganized.life. Myorganized.life.